In this video, the process of ovulation is fully explained. Ovulation is the part in the menstrual cycle when the ovary releases a mature egg otherwise called an ovum. Usually, only one egg is released in each ovulation. However, there may be few circumstances when more than an egg is released during the ovulation period. Watch to the end, like subscribe and drop your comments to enable us serve you better. Each ovary contains several thousands of immature follicles. A follicle is a ball of cells with the egg at the center. Beginning from the first day of each menstrual cycle, a few follicles begin to grow. Each of these follicles secrete estrogen into the bloodstream which helps prepare the uterus for possible pregnancy. At about the seventh day of a 28 days cycle, only one of these follicles, known as the dominant follicle continues to grow. The other follicles which at this time had suffered restriction in growth degenerate. At about day 12 of the menstrual cycle, this follicle pours out large amount of estrogen into the bloodstream which stimulates the hypothalamus to secrete gonadotropin releasing hormone GnHR. This hormone triggers a surge in the release of luteinizing hormone LH. The LH surge causes rapid growth spot on the follicle with the egg pushed towards the surface. At about day 14, the egg becomes most prominent as a bulge on the surface of the follicle. The follicle continues to swell until it bursts open, releasing the egg and fluid into the abdomen or pelvic cavity. On the funnel end of the tube are finger-like structures, the fimbri which immediately sweep around the liberated egg, directing it towards the lumen of the tube. The rhythmic movement of tiny microscopic hair-like structures known as cilia and the contraction of the smooth muscle of the tube help propel the egg towards the isthmus where fertilization may occur. The egg is viable for 12 to 24 hours before it dies if there is no healthy sperm to bring about fertilization. Thereafter, it is then shed off with the prepared uterine lining as menses.